Hello, I'm Bob McNair, founder and CEO of the Houston Texans. As a member of the Texas Business Hall of Fame, it gives me great pleasure to introduce to you a new member of the Texas Business Hall of Fame, Robert Duncan of Transwestern Properties. I've known Robert for over 40 years and I've watched him develop as a young businessman, uh, starting out first with Trammell Crow and then starting Transwestern in 1978. His success has been remarkable. He's well respected throughout the business circles and real estate circles throughout not only Houston and the Southwest, but throughout the country. His uh, company does an outstanding job and it's as a result of his leadership. I've also known Robert's family and I've seen them grow up through these years and they are a proud addition to Houston. We're just delighted to have him and I couldn't be more pleased to introduce him to you as the next member of the Texas Business Hall of Fame. Robert Duncan finds balance through his faith, through his family, and through a work ethic that is inspiring. He has steered his real estate company, Transwestern, through crashes, irrational exuberance, and the new normal. Uh, it was in, the, in, the, in the, uh, the late 70s, and the market was particularly uh, uh, good. Uh, we had, uh, had really good solid demand and we had undersupplied markets, we were in the development business, we had uh, attractive financing, um, and so it was a really good time for us to um, do what we thought we knew how to do, which was develop a spec uh, uh, office and warehouse and, and retail space in the Texas markets. The company started as a real estate investment developer and all we did was build properties and lease and manage what we built. And then it was the crash of the mid-80s that caused the company, and, and really Robert, I think, uh, uh, deserves the, the, the credit for seeing through what was going to happen and then, and then leading us uh, through a result that ended up being what, what we are today. Uh, goodness gracious, we had to do a great bit of financial engineering at the asset level, and then we had to figure out we were all dressed up and no place to go. We had to figure out uh, what we were going to do. So we had to figure out, now wait a minute, we need to, we, 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 we really, uh, we put our organization first. We felt like our biggest asset was our people and our organization, uh, and that was the right priority. That planning has yielded incredible growth and strength in the industry. Transwestern today is a commercial real estate company with a national footprint. 2009 saw real estate transactions with a dollar volume of 2.5 billion investment transactions of over 800 million, a management and leasing portfolio of over 200 million square feet. And through its private equity investment group, Transwestern has acquired over 12 billion of real estate assets over the past 15 years, putting over 5 billion of equity under management. In business, Robert is my hero. I mean, he's more handsome than I am, uh, he's more prolific than I am, not by much. He's built a much bigger company. Um, he's got a great family. Uh, everybody likes him. You know, most people like me, but not everybody. And so it's very hard to compete against your hero. We got started almost as similar. It was a few years before I retired in 1977. I, we started the Staubach Company, and Transwestern was like 1978. And, they kind of got involved in a lot of development and of course now it's a full service uh, real estate firm and their reputation is phenomenal. Robert Duncan is a humble man and quick to point out the places and the people that have formed his character. He came here, uh, it changed his life and then what an impact he's had on Houston, on the state of Texas, on America, uh, on the world uh, and he's uh, recognizing that it, it did start here. It started in his family, it started in a lot of places, uh, but UT was one of the transformative uh, aspects of his life and he's been so wonderful in partnering with us. I can also look and give, give uh, credit to a single individual and that is my bride, Marcy. Um, it's funny because we, uh, we have six boys and uh, when people hear that or they uh, that, I, that, that don't know us or whatever, the first thing they say is, your wife must be a saint. And she is. 
Generosity plays a pivotal role in his balancing act. Robert Duncan was a major donor for the new Tellepson Family YMCA in downtown Houston. And he sits on the board of the St. Luke's Episcopal Hospital System. To celebrate this life in balance and a humility to realize that this journey has not been done alone, the Texas Business Hall of Fame honors Robert Duncan. There's no question in my mind that this is that our company, Transwestern, is really who's being recognized here. And they've designated me to be the one to come up to the stage and, and bring home the hardware. So it's on behalf of, of our whole uh, company and all of our people and contributors that have, that have done so much for so many years that I, I humbly accept this, uh, this, uh, this honor.